the idea is just kind of like a crazy combination of, of names, right? Like Chicano, somebody's, you know, identity, and then Batman being a pop cultural symbol. So it's just like the two put together just sound interesting and sounds different and can mean all kinds of different things. Her blood was red, but now it's blue. She no longer smiles at you. Love is the most important, you know, feeling that you could possibly feel in life. So, you know, every, we all feel that, you know, together, you know, on our own and really just trying to have people tap into that, you know, um, as a means to, to feel free, as a means of being free and, and escaping all the, all the, you know, things that, that oppress us. One, one aspect of it is just like, you know, try to represent people of color in general, you know what I'm saying? Just trying to rep, you know, who we are and, and really ev everybody who's underrepresented. I mean, everybody has certain 60s and 70s music, right? So whether they're, you know, white or, or black or anything like that, they could relate to that sound. But obviously if you're Latino, you know, they, they understand those references that we soaked up as we grew up, you know? They could feel that. At the heart of what we do, we got our old school classic ruffles. And it's like the music we've referenced. It's like 70s classic music, late 60s. And then above it, we got like the modern cut suits. And it's like us bringing like the modern tip of music and combined Chicano Batman. At the end of the day, we're all trying to spread peace and love through our music. You know, it's literally what we're trying to do. One, two, three. Four chords, strings, we bring melody. Defunct. Where rhythm is life, and, and life, life is rhythm. rhythm. <laughs> <laughs>